हेलो स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज बी एस अकेडमी क्लासेस प्रेजेंट बाय संदीप स्टूडेंट्स फ्रॉम द लास्ट फ्यू लेक्चर आई एम डिस्कसिंग द डेटा इंटरप्रिटेशन पार्ट नाउ आई विल नाउ इन दिस पार्ट आई विल डिस्कस द नंबर सिस्टम एंड अगेन द डेटा इंटरप्रिटेशन पार्ट आई विल डेफिनेटली डिस्कस इन द फ्यूचर वीडियो सो स्टूडेंट फ्रॉम द पॉइंट एग्जाम पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू द नंबर सिस्टम इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर योर एग्जाम एंड फॉर एग्जाम्पल द नंबर सिस्टम विल कम इन 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 योर Uh, government exams, UGC NET exam, and many 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 government exams. Okay, so this number system is very uh, important. So we will discuss only that part which is very important for your exam point of view. So students, in the number system, we will discuss generally discuss uh, four type of number system: decimal number system, binary number system, octal number system, and the hexadecimal number system. So here. so in this part i am discussing the number system so for now in this particular part uh, now first you i am in this uh, video i am only telling you about the the basic concept of the number system in the future video i will uh, convert I, i will discuss the, the how can we convert one number system into another number system so here the i am writing i am writing the some of the basic number system which we have to study in a, for your exam point of view for example we have to discuss the decimal number system decimal number system second one is the binary number system third one is the octal number system and the fourth one is the hexadecimal number system so uh, decimal number system is having the base 10 why it is 10 i am i will tell you in just moment after some some moment now binary base is two base octal means 8 so its base is 8 and hexadecimal its base is 16 now the third part is number of digits the decimal is comprised of 10 digits which is 0 to 9 so its digits are 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 9 the binary is having only the two uh, digits which is 0 and 1 octa octal means 8 so it is having the eight digits which is 0 to 7 so 0 1 2 3 4 5 and 7 in hexadecimal we is we having the it is having the 15 digit 16 digits from 0 to 9 and to represent the 10 11 14 10 11 12 13 14 15 we is we can represent by using a b c d e and f so 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 9 and a b c d e and f so by using uh, the a is represented by the 10 so 10 is represented by the a then similarly uh, 11 is represented by the b 12 by c 13 by d and 14 by e and 15 by f so these are Uh, some of the number system which we have to study for your for our exam point of view now here the student the highest value or the highest digit for example the decimal is having the 10 base so its highest value is 9 so 10 minus 1 means highest value is 9 similarly the by in binary case in case of binary we the base is 2 so its highest value is 2 minus 1 which is 1 similarly 8 minus 1 the, the then the resultant is 7 so its highest value highest digit is 7 similarly in case of hexadecimal it is having the highest it is having the base as 16 so its highest digit is 16 minus 1 which is f means 15 uh, in the 15 is shown can be represented by the f so students um, these are some of the number system which we have to study for our exam point of view so this is just a, our introductory now for the exam point of view we have to understand how can we convert 
uh, one number system into another system. Uh, now I am discussing that part which we, we will discuss in the future. Now student, uh, one of the question that, that was asked in uh, 2017 uh, question paper in January. The, here the question was saying that uh, the if if any number can be represented, sup suppose that the uh, number is 49. The 49 can be represented by using uh, decimal number system, binary number system or the octal number system or the hexadecimal number system. The way of representation may be different but its value always remains the same. So any number can be represented by the any number system and their representation may be different. Its, uh, its uh, representation may be different but its value always remains the same in each and every number system. So please student note down that concept. Here now, here I will discuss some of the conversion which we will, I will take in our future video and it is very important for your exam point of view. So, conversion First conversion is from decimal to binary or vice versa means similarly binary to decimal. Now 90% of the time this this type of question comes in our question uh, comes in our exam paper okay so decimal to binary and binary to decimal it is very important for our exam point of view now second one is decimal to octal decimal to octal or octal to decimal again decimal to hexadecimal and hexadecimal to octal. Fourth one is binary to octal or octal to binary. Similarly, we, uh, we, ha we having uh, binary to hexadecimal and hexadecimal to binary. And the last and which is very important which is octal to hexadecimal and hexadecimal to octal. So strength. Uh, now these are some of the most important conversion which we have to study in a, for our exam point of view. So decimal to binary and binary to decimal, then decimal to octal and octal to decimal, then decimal to hexadecimal and hexadecimal to octal, binary to octal, octal to binary and then binary to hexadecimal, hexadecimal to binary and again octal to hexadecimal and hexadecimal to octal. So student. These are some of the conversion which we have to study for our exam point of view. Okay, so uh, now uh, if you convert any convert any number system to any, uh, any number system, you can easily uh, convert it. Uh, but uh, I will teach you some another method. Uh, this method is very uh, popular. Um, you may you may be find that this, you you may not find this in uh, one of the any book. But uh, I will discuss so to understand that particular method. I am discussing, uh, I am uh, writing some of the digits, just write, right now just you write down the all the digits and how can you, how can we this 
you just help you in your exam i will definitely tell you okay so here i am writing some of the values and some of the digit because in the percentages also uh, i discuss you many of the values which you uh, which you uh, which you have written that particular part in your uh, that time in your lecture but definitely these ha values help you in your exams okay so here for example uh, whenever you convert decimal number system into uh, in binary so the here the base is 2 so i am writing the sum of the uh, power of 2 so so please student write down the all this power for example 2 raised to power 0 is 1 2 raised to power 1 is 2 2 raised to power 2 is 4 2 raised to power 3 is 8 uh, 2 raised to power 4 is 16 2 raised to power 5 is 32 2 raised to power 6 is 64 2 raised to power 7 is 128 okay now uh, 2 raised to power 8 is 120 uh, sorry uh, 256 256 2 raised to power 9 is 512, 2 raised to power 10 is 1024, 2 raised to power 11 is 2048, 2 raised to power 12 is 4096. Now it is now enough. Uh, whenever uh, we convert any number, any decimal number into binary, now uh, this will, this this number will help help us. So these all these value will help us in binary. So I am writing that particular part. Now, for example, if you can convert any number into octal, so uh, please uh, write all these values: eight raised to power zero, one, eight raised to power one is eight, eight raised to power two is sixty-four, eight raised to power three is five one two. So now, for your exam point of view, uh, these. Uh, all these values are very important. Now, uh, 8 raised to power 3 is now quite enough for us, for our exam point of view. We, we don't need to write 8 raised to power 4, 8 raised to power 5, it doesn't matter. Okay. So, now for the hexadecimal conversion, 16 raised to power 0 is 1, 16 raised to power 1 is 16, and 16 raised to power 2 is 256. Now, all these values will help us whenever we convert any number into hexadecimal. So for the time being, just you write all these value in your notebook, and it will help you whenever we, uh, whenever we solve all the other question or all our question paper. Okay. So please, for the time being, please write down all these value. So students, uh, in this introductory video, I I just discuss only that particular part which is uh, important for your uh, number system because in this part we discussed to. Uh, four kind of number system, decimal number system, binary number system, octal number system and the hexadecimal system, number system. Uh, we discussed uh, how many digits they, these all number system comprised of and also we discussed what kind of conversion which, which we will study in our future video and also we discussed some of the values and how can these value help us in our future video. I will definitely tell you. So, if you still you find any problem in your understanding or any difficulty of facing in your exam preparation please mail to my email id sandeep2006 triple item at the rate gmail.com okay students thank you